Welcome to our last day from Hawaii. We had a great trip, we had fun. I hope you enjoyed the AirPods video, that was a lot of fun, and then some of the vlogs that we had. Today we take off at 10 p.m. to fly all the way back to Utah on a direct flight, land in the morning, the red eye. We have a disaster of a hotel room right now. We're gonna pack up really quick. We have less than 90 minutes to get to the airport. There is a flight to Kauai. This is gonna sound ridiculous because it is ridiculous. There's a place called Puka Dogs on Kauai. And it's the best place in the world. The best hot dogs that we've ever had. It has been probably four years since we've been there. It's not the fanciest of places, but it's worth it. If you're on Oahu and you're that close and we've craved it for so long, we've gotta find a way to get there. So we're gonna go to the airport, see if we can get a flight, get out of here, and go to Kauai just to buy a hot dog. That's right. Let the hot dog adventure last day in Hawaii begin. We don't have a flight at all, we don't have tickets, but our flight, the flight that we want to take leaves in about 35 minutes. So now we've got to try to find where the ticketing counter is for this small airline. Very, very low chance that we're gonna make this. We just have to buy tickets, get on the plane, we might have to take the later flight. To Islandale? Yeah. Okay. on boarding, boarding. Not final call yet. Is there any chance we can get a ticket and get on the flight to Dubuie? No, they closed right off check-in already. Already closed? Yeah. All right. What's the next flight? Next one is not till 2.13. All right, a bit of change of plans. Um, we have a few hours till our flight. We're gonna go and do a little something that I've wanted to do for a long time. I've told you guys that I run stairs. I like running the tallest building in every state and Hawaii is a state I have not done. So this uh, missing the flight is a blessing in disguise because now we're gonna go try to sneak in to the tallest building in Hawaii, the first Hawaiian center and see if I can run the stairs and get super sweaty and then spend the rest of the day and fly home in the same clothes. <laughs> not a smart idea. You wanna run it with me? No. Look at this building, very pretty. This is the lobby. We found it, we're on the go. Let's get moving. I know this doesn't seem like much because it's a window. Like, what's the big deal? You usually don't have windows in the emergency stairwell, so. This is unique to this building. I haven't seen it in other skyscrapers. So yeah, I'm taking a break and checking it out. I'm super sweaty, but because it's so incredibly humid up here at the top. There's the top, you can have a view. This is the first one I've done with the beautiful view. Wyoming had a view, but it was only like an 11 story dorm. Going upstairs is really, fine with your legs, but going down is where you get hurt. Um, it's really tough on your thighs, your hips, your knees. All the doors are locked on the whole way up, so I have to go all the way down to the basement. Yeah, 17 floors down and my legs are feeling like jello. Going down is the hardest part. Why is it so much harder to go down than up? It's so strange. We're almost there. Okay, we did it. We're back to where we began. Problem is, check this out. Emergency exit only. You can push that button and call somebody. No thanks, I'm gonna wait. I just called Zach. He's gonna come open the door that I came in if he can get to it. So now we wait. Good timing. We made it out. Zach saved the day. I'm a little stinky, but thank you, Zach. Hey, Link. I made it. Good. Good. Should we get out of here? Yeah. The original Pancake House. This place looks awesome already. 100% confident that we are the only tourist in here, which makes me feel like we are at the right place. What? Okay, look at this omelet here. That is legit. Look at this ham and cheese omelet. What even, I've never even seen one this way. Nick, it has chocolate chip pancakes. 
Awesome. Awesome. And of course, I got the Hawaiian pancakes with pineapple. As Casey Neistat would say, back at the airport. It's raining and windy outside. They, every single one of them, they all say don't do it. It's not worth it. It's, there's already been flights that have been delayed today. And so there's a good chance that we wouldn't make our flight tonight. They did say that if it was a sunny day, absolutely they'd say go for it. No big deal. But they think it's too risky. What's the weather report look like? It'll, it's still supposed to rain the rest of the day. Well, I'm not missing any flights. So <laughs> I'm ready to do whatever. Yeah. I want to go. I want to go too. We're going. But I'm thinking it's not wise. We have a first class flight with a bed to get home. We have school tomorrow. So I think what we need to do is just probably just stay here. Doesn't sound as exciting. We just came to the airport twice for no reason. So we need to make up for that and have a good rest of the day. Next time you see us, we're gonna be doing something awesome on a rainy day in Hawaii. This is that awesome place that I told you about. I said, the next shot you're gonna see is something awesome. We drove for an hour and 15 minutes out here to Seven Brothers just to get a burger and shake. And then we had to drive an hour and 15 minutes back to get to the airport. Is it worth it, Lincoln? Yes. We didn't get our hot dogs today. No puka dogs in Kauai. Um, but yes, this is good enough. You got the shem the with shem rice. with rice and chocolate shake. This is the end. Of the world. Of our trip for the world. Goodbye. Yeah. You've been awesome. It's been really fun. We need to do more projects together with Zach. So uh, let us know what you'd like us to do, where I can be the muscle and he can be the brains. <laughs> That's right? how this works. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> we got our jobs divvied out. It's pretty good. We can set up. No Dr. Pepper. We made it to the Sky Lounge. We have a couple of hours. We came here early. We're gonna relax for a bit. Hey, look at this. Sound good? It actually, oh. Alright, tell me about the trip, Lincoln. Was it a good trip? Yeah, sadly it has to come to an end. Yep. Thank you, good night. How you doing, bud? Hand over the iPad. I'm using my headphones to have the um, sound machine on it. You're gonna play games. I'm not. I'm gonna You're sleep. You're gonna play Smashy Bird the whole time. I'm gonna sleep. You will? Yeah. Promise? Yeah, I promise. You the whole that. chair turns into a bed. It's not a bad deal. Slept a few hours. Lincoln looked pretty awake, just from what I saw, but whew, that's a tough one. How you doing, bud? How's the flight? It's good. I'm so tired. Do you sleep at all? Yeah, of course. That's how I did the entire flight. I'm still so tired. Yeah. As good as it gets right here. It won't turn on. Well, yeah, that's happening. Okay. Look at this. The window won't even shut properly. See that? Check it out. Nice way to welcome ourselves home. See if the back door will even open. Nope. Car won't start. Why? I don't know. Dead? Dead. That's awesome. They're gonna bring a tow truck to the airport and I've gotta go back there to get the car. They're gonna take it home. Super fun way to get back. <laughs> Girls! Claire, my Claire, my girlie. London, my girlie.